Warning, this video obviously contains spoilers. This may or may not be the right plot to the game, but it's the generally accepted one from what I've seen. In 1890, a man named Booker DeWitt participates in the Wounded Knee Massacre, the last battle of the American Indian War that results in 300 Native American men, women, and children being slaughtered by a U.S. Cavalry Regiment. Shortly after this, Booker starts feeling remorse for what he's done and turns to Christianity. It is here he learns in order to wipe away all of his sins, he must participate in a baptism. Are you ready to have your sins cleansed? Are you ready to be born again? Now this is where Infinite Theme begins. There are infinite universes based off of different yet similar events. For example, in the Walking Dead game, there are different endings based off of how you play the game. One ending may end up with you BFFs with Kenny, and one ending may end up with you not so cool with Clementine. There are crap ton of endings, or universes, for one to explore. With this in mind, we go back to the baptism of Booker DeWitt. In one universe, Booker accepts the baptism, and was reformed into Zachary Comstock. He meets a woman named Rosalinda Ludic, where they become super close, develop a machine that can transport you through time and space, and also create the floating city of Columbia. Unfortunately, due to the traveling through time and dimensions, Comstock becomes sterile and cannot conceive a child of his own. Around this time, Rosalinda meets Robert, the guy version of Rosalinda in a parallel universe. With Robert's help, Comstock finds out that the universe Robert is from has a Booker DeWitt with a child, Anna DeWitt. Comstock offers through Robert that if Booker brings Comstock Anna, he will wipe away all of Booker's gambling debt. What choice do I have? Booker reluctantly agrees and Comstock raises Anna as his own, under the name Elizabeth. However, Comstock realizes that his wife, Lady Comstock, showed no signs nine months into pregnancy and had her assassinated along with the Ludix to cover this up. Still fearing Booker for no apparent reason, Comstock created the whole story about Booker being the false shepherd and quickly convinces the citizens of Columbia of this, thus creating an army for the day that Booker arrives. If this wasn't enough, he created the songbird as a guardian for Elizabeth so that if Booker or anyone else got close to Elizabeth, no one would survive. He then puts Elizabeth in a tower, which limits her power to create tears into other universes. With this in mind, we go back to a universe where Booker did not accept the baptism. He becomes the Pinkerton investigator and starts a family. You didn't go through with it. You think a dunk in the river is going to change the things I've done? Still uneasy about the events of Wounded Knee, he loses his wife when his gambling addiction comes to the point where he is willing to sell his own daughter, Anna, to wipe away his debt. Realizing what he's done, he tries to revoke the offer, resulting in Anna's pinky finger getting cut off. My daughter! No! Twenty years goes by, Booker falls into a depression and cuts his daughter's initials into his right hand as a penance for what he's done. He almost dies until Ross and Linda and Robert come back from the dead to take you to the universe in which Columbia and Comstock live in. They're still kind of pissed that Comstock killed them and that if not stop, Comstock will destroy millions of cities throughout the infinite universe. They offer a chance of redemption and a chance to see Anna again to Booker. It is here where the entire game of infinite takes place. At the end, once you destroy the tower, Elizabeth's powers are fully available. She can finally understand that by killing Booker DeWitt before he goes through with the baptism, he will never become the Comstock that created Columbia, which in turn prevents the entire game from happening. Booker and Anna DeWitt still may be alive in other universes, but a universe with Comstock and Elizabeth are slim to none. The post credit scenes may be a Booker from a parallel universe, and all the events and memories of the game transfer over into this Booker. Realizing what he's done was wrong, he runs to check if Anna is still around, <laughs> ending in mystery. Is that you?